Hello guys and girls, Voices from the Dark here, welcome back to the Savior of Skyrim with Mimir Many Life standing here before the statue of Clavicus Vile and Barbus, the amazing dog. That's probably going to be the last intro featuring that guy right there. But we got places to go, don't we, Raya? We are going out of this place, leaving it behind, not thinking about the empty dog-shaped hole in our chests. Because, well, the row goes on. It's episode 99, and we have some setup to do before the big 100. Oh, there come the clear sound again. That's nice. Well then, not everything is lost. We got our horsey. So Frost and I, and I suppose our companion, who's now our soul companion, so I think I need to start treating my human companions better. We're gonna go to Riverwood. If you remember, way back when, we were looking for the horn of uh, Jorgen Windcaller, and we got to the end of the dungeon, clearing all the enemies, doing all the work, and we were met with a note, which I probably don't have with me at this point. But it pointed, and let's just get it up on the map, this would be the Horn of Jürgen Windcaller. Someone had taken the horn and asked me to meet them at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood? That's preposterous, and that's exactly where we're going. We're continuing main quest for a little bit here, so... That's always reason to be excited for my series. You okay there? You look a little... out of it. Are the other people at the camp making fun of you? Maybe you just need some alone time. That's fine, I'm not gonna... Well, there's not... Oh. They're having a secret rendezvous out in the woods. All right. You do you, Stormcloaks. You do you. Now, once we meet with them, hopefully we'll be able to get the horn. Because if we get the horn back, we could take it to the Greybeards and unlock a certain shout, which is iconic and very dearly missed. This is not the right way, but could I go here? Uh, this seems like the fun way. Yeah, sure. Yeah, you can get to Riverwood by going through Orphan Rock. Of course you can. Watch me. We're gonna we're gonna find a way. You know, life life finds a way. That that whole spiel. Just instead of dinosaurs, it's it's me. All right, you feared poorly. Look, it's it's basically a path. They just forgot to mark it properly on the map. Look at this. We've a oh. Sorry, Frost. Look out for bear traps. I, he's a horse. I thought he'd be fine. <laughs> but I guess that's that's not how this any of this works. What is this? Oh. Oh, no, Frost. Get out of here. This is no battle for you. It's a battle for me and nobody else. Oh, uh, it's almost like having a horse makes me faster than my companions, which means that there we go. Didn't doubt Raya for a second. Ah, yes. Let's go. Let's try to get you a new weapon, girl. You're, you're swinging around a pickaxe there. That's fine. She's just reminding me. You know, it's just a painful reminder that pickaxes aren't used to chop wood. And uh, somehow I need that reminder. Just take arrows. Why am I taking arrows? I don't know. It just feels... Arrows are... Oh, he was considering leaving me leaving me alive. Well, that's, that's something. Oh, hey there. Yeah. Flame is, flame is cool and all, but not sure that's where your attention should be. We're headed at the moment, Mr. Bandit Thug. Lay down and bleed to death. Oh. Or you can heal. You're all, that's only going to prolong the inevitable, Mr. Get, get, you, get, you get back here. Get back here. Why do I have flames on hotkey? I never use flames. I could have a more potent kind of destruction spell here, but that's... It's just something about good old flames, you know? It's still a, a carryover from when we first escaped Helgen. <sighs> All those months ago. Almost two years now. Of straight at Skyrim episode weekly, baby. Yellow Book of Riddles. I know we got that one. Coin purse. Wooden door. All right. What makes this area cleared, I wonder? North Skybound Watch. Maybe it cannot be, but we'll look around a little bit, see what else the Skybound Watch has to offer. 56 gold. Okay, loving the view here. 
Oh, pedestal. Beautiful. Don't see that every day. Oh, it's something. It is something, all right. Flick Falls Barrows. Riverwood down below. Uh, how am I supposed to get my horse through this? Can I? Surely, my surely I can. Frost. Oh. Oh no. Frost. Where'd you go, buddy? Um. I feel like I just saw Frost. Did he run off into the woods? Well, maybe that's better for him. Raya's here. That's a rabbit. And that's... Hmm. Well, it sure was nice having a horse. But... Huh? I... I mean, surely... I mean, Raya... Raya. Frost will catch up. I know they will. Well, they're just going on a little adventure. Who... I can't, I can't cramp their style, okay? Are they out there? Somewhere. Do they run far? Oh, there you are. Okay. You're staying at a safe distance. That's okay. You've had some tendencies to dive into combat, and I think maybe I prefer you stepping a little bit away from us. Now then. Let's get down to Riverwood, see the people again. We should have everything completed quest-wise in Riverwood. Oh, we can! This is so cool! Thank you, Todds. Whee! All right, here we go. And hold on, out, hold on. Hold on, yes! Let's, let's not go, let, let, let's use the stairs like a normal, or, you know, this is alternative stairs. Everything is stairs if you want it to be. Wonderful! All right, Frost. You know what's up. We're going down to Riverwood. See the people again. Try not to look Sven's mother in the eyes. Oh, God. But it's fine. As I said, it's fine. All right, we're, we're going we're gonna to come in from above. Give him a real, real sneak, sneak attack. Oh, be careful here. Be very careful here. Oh boy, Carl, come on, dude. Why? Oh, the eagle! The eagles are coming! Oh, can I land on an eagle with a horse? Watch me. Watch me. Never been done. Where'd the eagle go? It's a mountain eagle, I guess. All right. Oh, it's raining on my parade. All right. Ho oh, what? Ho oh, what? And. Ho ha! <laughs> Perfect. With that, back in Riverwood. Man, it's been a while. How are ya? How do you feel? I think you might be sick. I'm doing good. It's just good to see your face. I'm spoken for, you know, so don't get any ideas. Alright. She doesn't like me, Frost. That's okay. Well then. We we cool? Yes, we're cool with the city guards. My eyes open. Damn dragons could swoop down at any time. Literally. Well then, how we doing out here, Alvor? How's business? Whatever you need. Buy Ismir if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. What have we got for sale? Take a look. Let's... I don't much care. But I could sell you something fun. Something wicked. Do you want the vampire armor of minor conjuration? Ooh... Glass sword. Oh, he can't. He doesn't quite have the money. That's okay. Mask of clavicus vile. Hmm. Honestly, I I should be equipped. I mean, it doesn't really it doesn't really matter. I could sure I could equip better speech gear and sell things for more money, but then they're gonna run out of money sooner, and I I can't sell them everything I want to sell them. So it's like, eh. I'm just, I'm just gonna sell them the freaking ebony bow. I didn't I want to have an ebony bow so I could shoot arrows. Well, you... A fine day to you, friend. Hey. May you die with a sword in your hands. Indeed. Oh, Sven, Sven's mother. Opposite direction. Let's go. <gasps> Barbies. How are you, Barbies? Papa says I'm too friendly with strangers. But you seem all right. Yes. I'm going to take your dog. Take your dog far away from here. <gasps> yeah. My father is Alvor, the blacksmith. Did not I'm ask. Just... We're going to the Sleeping Giant Inn. Welcome. Let me know to if meet. you want with whoever could have sent that letter. All right. Here we go. 
uh, don't stand so far away from the counter. It's just awkward. <sighs> You're really gonna make me go around. Hey. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. Mm, you don't deal with the rooms, mm -hmm. do ya? If you want a room. Talk to Delphine. Talk to Delphine. That visitor been poking around. Yeah. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Um, I'd like to rent the attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Ah, well, that's, that's, that's awkward. Yeah, it's, uh, don't know why I assumed an attic room. It's Riverwood. just what the, what the note said, so, you know. Well, well, well. Ah, time to gorge on wine. Fall from glory. Indeed, more gold. Yes, Dragonborn likes gold. Very good. Wine, apples. I could get used to this place. Very nice. Uh, owned bed? Excuse me? Did I not? What's this wardrobe? All right. Not allowed to go there. Well, well, this is an owned bed. Most of my customers are locals. Come here that to relax after a hard day's toil. Where's my room again? Next to the door. The room on the left. Sure. I can't sleep, though. We've gotten the attic room. And she said uh, it's the room directly on the left. So this? You mean you mean the the bed where? Why can't I, why can't I buddy up to Embry? Come on, what's what's wrong with that? Get out of the My bed. Favorite drinking buddy. No Let's no no, get, get out of the bed. It's I'm I'm gonna use this bed now. Thank you. Ah, uh, just gonna sleep, enjoy the night. Hmm. A great evening I've had in this room. Yes. Anything else gonna happen now? Now that I've slept, what's in this room? Is this mine? Is this the room I sleep in to make the thing happen? Oh, oh, oh it's the one. It's the one. It's the one. I just so you're the dragon boy. Had to follow basic you instructions. Okay. I think you're looking for this. <gasps> Order where your wind caller. Follow me. We need to talk. All right. You just you just gotta sleep in the bed she says to sleep in. It's weird how that works. Look at this though. Horn of Jurgen wind caller. Let me let me see that. Let me see that. Whoa, that looks weird. <laughs> All right, sure, Jurgen. Sure. Well, I'll follow Delphine. I'll follow you anywhere. Where are we going? Magical wardrobe. Close the door. Oh, right. Raya, secret business. Now we can talk. Freaking Narnia up in here. Let's go. All right. Raya, secret business. There we go. She wouldn't understand. Oh! Doesn't take social cues very well. That's fine. Same, honestly. Okay. All right. Dramatic the graybeards close. seem to think you're the dragonborn. I hope they're right. You're the one who took the horn. Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. What's with all the cloak and dagger? You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. What do you want with me? I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Go on. I'm listening. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. Maybe. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. How do I know I can trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. Well, fool's my middle name. 
Why did you take the horn from Ustengroff? I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were Dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeard sent, and not some Thalmor plant. Why are you looking for a Dragonborn? We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate Dragon Slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? That's a bit of a personal question. Yes, that's how I first learned I was dragonborn. Good, and you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. You... You said the Thalmor are after you. Yes. We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. So what's the part you're not telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. You know how crazy this sounds? <laughs> a few years ago, I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. Well, it turned out he was right and I was wrong. What makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. And I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. So, how did you figure all this out? You should know. You got the map for me. The Dragonstone you got for Faringar, remember? Right. You were at Dragon's Reach when I gave it to him. So you were paying attention. I arranged to have Faringar recover the Dragonstone for me. It's what I do. I make things happen from behind the scenes. After all, here you are. The Dragonstone was some kind of map? Yes. A map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, starting in the Geralds near Riften. The one near Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. So where are we headed? Kynesgrove. There's an ancient dragon That's burial near there. Map. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Hmm. I know that mound. High on the hill, east of Kynesgrove. Good. Good. Now we won't have to spend time searching for it. We should get moving. There's no time to waste. Let's go kill a dragon. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Alright, let's get traveling gear on. It's gonna take this. That's better. There we go. Let's get on the road to Kynesgrove. Rise and fall on the blades, huh? Rise and fall. What we got here? Potion of destruction. The warrior stamina. Minor magic. A minor healing. Resist fire. Draw the health. Potion of health. I don't. Do I need them? I. Hmm. You know. Ice wraith teeth is fun though. Lord I need that. I'm traveling. Oh. Got the inn till I get back. Plot. Hold on. Resist magic. Scroll the dread zombie. Happy trails. Happy trails. Now then. We're off. On an adventure. Oh, it's a beautiful day to go slay a dragon, Delphine. Ah, oh, kind this is, good. is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. I mean, we could. Maybe I'll. I'll go with you a little bit. I, I also got to take the horn back, and it'd be really fun to go get that shout. Uh, wait, we uh, we moving together, or are you moving by yourself? Oh, oh, there there she goes. She just had to charge up. Gather up the courage to... Why are you stopping? I'm not going to follow you if you're going to do that. Okay. We got about the s same speed or am I faster? So my walk is too slow and my run is too fast. Yeah. She's a basic follow NPC, all right? I think we were pretty even speed wise. This is cool. This is cool. Raya always takes her sweet time in the back. You I really have to, like, keep up with. Ah, I see a spider over there. You like spiders, Delphine? I don't. Oh, wolves on the road. You ready? 
Don't be scared. Yup, ja. Yup, ba. All right. Arrow time. Oh, automatically went for that. Either she's hunting or she's killing that spider. That poor elk is just giving up on life right there. That's that's sad right there. Come on, fight back. My money's on the big one. Fight back, you stupid elk. Come on. I got it. All right. Don't worry. I, I got you. I got you, buddy. There you go. You are free. Now, oh. He's clearly rabid. I think we should... Oh, well. <laughs> what are you doing? I feel like you... Dude. Freaking Benny Hill elk over here. Right, get out of here. Get out of here, you silly. Very confused, that guy. That's okay. All right, Delphine. Let's keep going. We also see White Run right over there. We do got some stuff where we got to stop by White Run. We have the Nettlebane quest. I know we've been sent out to get various things around the land, and we haven't really gotten all of them. Like, Omran is his name. The Red Guard wants us to find the swords. I haven't really done that. Delphine, would you would you help me fight? Nah. Not worth it. Instead. Oh, they're catching up. They're catching up. Very good. Still like to stop by. Oh, now would be a good time to. S I mean, we're going to Kynesgrove. It's not that far. It's just. Isn't Kynesgrove like. Um, where's Kynesgrove? It's right. It's this. I, I know where Kynesgrove is, guys. Stop being. It's there? Right, yeah, Kynes Grove, the place by Windhelm. Uh, that is far. So yeah, we're gonna go with the uh, with the plan of stopping by the Greybeards as we're uh, as we're coming down here, I think. Uh, which means we'd want to traverse the throat of the world, and could have gone back up and through here. But I also think we could circle around, get the Ritual Stone, eh, and then we go around. But you know what we should do. Mm. Here's what we do. Uh, I left Frost, didn't I? Yeah, Frost's gone now. Frost and Riverwood, and that's basically half the world away. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna wold our way over to White Run, buy a horse. I don't believe we have actually bought a horse, so that would be something that is worth doing. And with said horse, we're gonna ride along the road, get that freaking ritual stone. And then head on up to the Greybeards. Get ourselves the Da in Vuzro Da and get powers beyond our imagination. I think, I think we can imagine things to do with it and people to blow off cliffs with it and game breaking bugs to introduce. I think we could. I think we could. Honestly, where could you take me, you know Bjorlum? I can take you to. Where do you want to go? You can only take me to big cities. Ah. Good day. You're nothing like my guy at home. Now oh, that guy, he can take me. Did I buy or did I buy a horse? I did buy a horse. Well, maybe many, many lives this horse. Here we go. Frost can just sort of figure out their life. We're gonna need a lot, a name for you. Uh, the White Run Horse. What should be your name? Your name will be a combination of the first two words that two different people speak to me in town with a hyphen beneath but between them okay here we go you you ready when you come out you're gonna have a beautiful name all right let's see let's see the first text that appears in subtitles first word from that and first word from the next text from someone else okay back in town what is it that we want to do here blessing of nature is definitely important for us to do here but is there really another thing that is in this town specifically fralia oh, the whole missing in action of course we finished that that's great that is great uh we still gotta hit some of those books actually who gets around to it innocence lost miscellaneous all right okay that's probably good. 
do, 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 do. What do you want to say to me? Olfred. Olfred? No, he said his own ball. name? A name I'm sure you know well. <laughs> okay, so Olfred something is the name of the horse now. <laughs> Don't say like Battleborn or something. It's, just, it's very white runish though. Oh. Oh, I thought that was Nassim. I was going to back away so I didn't get Nassim, uh, Nassim's input here. I'm just waiting for someone to speak. I'm mortified. Hey, Amran. Still working on that sword. Uh, Fralia. No, that's not Fralia. I know how Fralia looks. Wait, who's who's Fralia Greymane then? I thought that was... Hold on. That's the for, Forsaken Cave. That's, uh, that's, that's not what we're doing. Fralia Greymane. Right, Fralia Greymane, because you're Battleborn. How goes the oh, today, how? That's right, mop the town beggar like. All right, Alfred, how? Right it was. It was never going to be a winner. I'm sorry, you and freaking. I'm not saying. There's a rift here in Skyrim. There's a rift here in Skyrim. You kind of look this. Okay, you're not as old. I'm sorry. Please tell me you have news of my son. Thorald is safe. Is he? You've saved him. I must see him at once. I'm afraid he's not here. He didn't think it was safe to return. What? After all this, I can't even see him? How? How do I know you're telling me the truth and not just what I want to hear? He said to tell you to suffer the winter's cold winds. For it bears aloft next summer's seeds. That's my boy. So it's true then. For now, it's enough to know that he's alive. I can find peace in that. Thank you, dear friend. You've given me back my son. I'd had Jorland forge this for Thorald. It was to be a present for his return. I suppose he can't have it now. Why don't you take it? We can always make another for the day when this war ends and Thorald can come home. Steel Sword of Shocks. Oh no, it's like when you, you get a present at Christmas and everybody's watching and you're like, Oh, Grandma, you got me a Steel Sword of Shocks. Wow. That's, oh, you shouldn't have. Wow. This, have you heard from your sons? No, nor do I expect to. Would be too dangerous for now. Hmm. It's enough for me to know that they're out there somewhere and together again. You take care of yourself now. You too. What's the matter? You can't stand the sight of a strong Nord woman? You just My favorite stepped drink. in front of me and Let's confronted me. Whatever. Not gonna touch that. Instead, good look around. I'm, sure I'm gonna go sell a sister. Raya, what are you doing in the st what, what, what are you doing? You silly goose. Everything's for sale, my friend. And Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. That's great. Hold on. Let's let, we gotta do it at least once. Mask of Clavicus Vial. Do come back. Hello. I would like Don't to purchase to your finest wares. Some may call this junk. Me, Me I, call I call them, them treasures. treasures. Glass sword. I wanna get rid of this. There we go. Thank you so much. Remember, I'll give you the best. What are you doing now? Yeah, why did I jump over the table instead of walking around? Yes. Because I live life, Sigurd. I, I pulled sure both I Sigurd and Belothor out of the shop because I was in conversation with them when I exited the door. Uh, I guess someone said it's it's a feature. And I, yeah, I guess it is a feature. It's just a questionable feature. It's so weird. Like, I'm okay with if I walk out the door and someone's talking to me, it's okay for that conversation to cut off, you know? There's probably a reason. There we go. Iron helmet and major magic out. Back on the menu. All right, bits and bobbles. That would have been a good horse. I got. Oh, I don't like how. I don't like Olfred how. I need another like proper. Okay, give me something. Give me something. Olfred. Come to chat with an old. Olfred, come. <laughs> All right, Olfred, come, everybody. <laughs> she has spoken. She has spoken. All right, Nettlebane, where, where, where we got? Where, 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 where we got? All right, let's head on hey, over it. here. Temple of Kinnereth. Of course, I'm here all the time. Oh. What is it? 
What has happened to the Gilder Green? I have traveled long here to worship beneath its God branches. God bless you, Healer. It was taken by a lightning strike. Wish I had Pain time to so deal great. with it. But it's hard enough with all these wounded from the war. Please, don't just let it stay like this. It's disgraceful. I really don't have time to deal with you right now. Please just let me get back to my work. But this is supposed so to be sick. your work. Can hardly stand it. I feel better already. <laughs> okay, he's he's recovering already. That's great. That's what I say when I'm sick. Ah, oh, so sick. Ah. Oh. oh, healing altar. So, have you gotten Nettlebane back from those filthy hag ravens yet? Ah, uh, you betcha. I found Nettlebane for you. Oh, I. Well, I honestly didn't expect you to come back. Of course, I'm glad you did. Now. I don't really want to touch that thing, though. Do you think you could handle the next steps? Make it stop. What needs to be done? Elder Gleam Sanctuary Grove is to the east of here. You can use Nettlebane to retrieve some of its sap. Was I correct in hearing that you were traveling to the Grove of the Elder Gleam? Uh, yeah. Was I correct in hearing that you were traveling yeah. to the Grove okay. of the Elder Gleam? Can I help you? I am a traveler, a pilgrim. I follow the voice of Kinnereth wherever it can be heard. I've dreamed of seeing Elder Gleam for years. Might I travel alongside you? I promise not to get in the way. Thank you. The pain is already Sure. I'm kind of in the need of some company. I thank you for your kindness. Can't promise you'll live long, buddy. Is it much further to the sanctuary? Oh, you're one of those, huh? Oh, wow, well, and she's gone. All right, Kinnereth blessed me on this day. Looking for my husband, Nazim? Never. Never. That's usually where he stuffs himself these days. All right, Kinnereth. I think I deserve some payment. Oh, look at this. Maurice is just down. He's just down with the crowd. This so is great. Sick. Can hardly stand it. Yeah, so sick. You still have time to put up makeup in the morning, huh? I think she's faking it. Hmm. Acolyte Jensen. Need something? She's faking it. Let's get out of here. We got a quest to the Elder Gleam Sanctuary. Remind me, where on the map is that? Retrieve Elder Gleam Sap. Uh, Elder Gleam Sanctuary is over here. Okay, that's that's not that's kind of on the way actually, considering how we'd be traveling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can definitely stop by the Elder Gleam Sanctuary as we go towards the Dragon Burial site. Burial? Sure. Dragon Burial, everybody. That's what well, that's where we are right now. Current location. Back to High Rothgar we go. I would like to, but that means possibly. Iverstead's on the other side of the mountain. We there it's possible to scale it through different like look at look at this. There's clearly a path here. If I just I can probably make I should probably take the way. But I can if I can cut a corner here, that would save me some time. Okay. I just I just, I heard some screams that it's just uh, Mr. Ugh, what's Heimsker, of course. Blessing of Nature, Blade in the Dark, Horner Jürgen Windcaller. All really nice. Uh, stopped by, said hello to the peeps. Um, nothing more that I can immediately think of. So let's go back to Ulfred, come and hit. I've helped you out. You're my friend. You have all the vegetable soup ingredients just out and about. I oh. need to ask you to stop. Yeah, I won't Good. filter everything from the filter is not a it's not the word I was Maurice is a little um Fresh baked loaves. He, get, he gets a little close. You know, that there's this personal space thing he hasn't quite figured out. Well there we go. Good to be back. Alright, old Fridless freaking. Alright. Back outside. Alright, old Frid come. Can I change? You could probably change names through console commands, but I don't know how. Uh, is it? Do is there like a set, set name? No. Set AV name? No. There's probably a way. Maybe I'll look into it. All right, <laughs> Maurice. Wait, hold on. Is he important? Because honestly, I'm gonna take him up to High Rothgar now. But I. 
Is he important? Is I don't know, dude. I gotta read up on. I didn't gotta read some Maurice lore right here. On the journey, and due to his aggression, Maurice will attack all enemies regardless of his lack of weapons and can be a challenge to keep alive. However, he provides a much more peaceful option in the Elder Gleam Sanctuary, so he's worth looking out for? Ah. Uh, no. No. Okay, so it seems like we can get a bit more of a nice ending if we keep him alive. But like, dude, look at this guy. Look at this guy. Alright, Alfred, come. And the rest of you. Okay, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I'm trying to think here. What would be the best course of action? I could... If I take the carriage to Falkreath, and then I go home, and then I take that carriage to Iverstead, and then I climb the steps, you know, you know, with him, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take, I'm just gonna take Maurice. Screw it, I could just go to the, the sanctuary, but look, this is, these details. All right, I'm, I'm kind of digging it. All right, let's 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 just do this. It's a crazy plan. It ends up being a bad plan and ruins everything in the episode. Uh, Mr. Farah, bless me. Okay, we didn't load. All right, means we're good. Let's go. I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Take me to Paul Kriuth. We'll we're going to start doing some more carriage travel around when there's... You best hurry it up. Dude, doing it on my own time. Just because we're going to be traversing a lot of familiar grounds, and I want to get places. I want to get stuff done in the time that we have. All right, Maurice is here. Alfred Cum is here. And we're going to go. Head into town. Oh, it's actually going to be hard keeping Maurice alive here on this road, because there's two really aggressive bandits further up. And also, apparently, he's super aggressive. All right, let's see if I can get to the house at all. And if I'm gonna drag him to High Rothgar, there's there's like frost trolls out there. Oh, you missed fire, bless me. You best behave, buddy. We're in big trouble. I mean it. All right, we got Raya with us. I was kind of like, yay, another person to add to the crew. All right. Branch in the road. I know the way home, though. All right, rock trap gone off. The bandits are there. Okay, Maurice, this is the first test, okay? You have no weapons. You could possibly drop something for you to pick up in combat, but I don't really want you in combat. All right, Miss Fire, bless me. This means we don't get the ritual stone, but that's okay. All right. Oh, it worked! I summoned Flamey up there. All right. I'm gonna make my way over to Archer Boy on this side. And hope that Maurice doesn't do anything stupid. It's not the end of the world if he dies, honestly. It doesn't really impact completion as far as I understood. Yeah. But it'd be, it'd be, it's, it's a nice challenge. And challenge is sort of the name of the, the, name of the game. It's not the savior of Skyrim. Uh, uh, walk in the park, you know. It's not a walk in the. S there's, there's, there's some, there's, there's something there. It's meant to test my metal and my might. What better way than stupid freaking NPCs to protect? All right, I'll take that. Ah, uh, there we. Oh, Maurice! Oh, don't what? Oh, don't run into Boulder. He's gonna kill himself on that Boulder. They're very potent. Oh, he's 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 very confused right now. That's fine. Bolt. Now then, you did well staying out of trouble. Ah, right, of course he. You waited for me, dude. Love in the fog around Falkreath. Let's get back up on the horse. Let's go home, dude. Lucy is gonna be overjoyed. Seeing her papa back. Oh no. Oh. 
No, 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 no. Watch out for the boulders. Damn you, you say. Don't walk into the boulder. It hurt. It hurts you. Okay. Raya was just making sure he didn't run into the boulders. She was keeping the boulders at bay. This is great. This is really great. I don't really see what all the boulders... It's, it's, boulders... Boulder skate jokes aren't aren't relevant anymore. Stop. Don't don't even think or try. I've not played boulder skate, by the way. I'm sure I'd like it. That's kind of the problem. I don't want to play a game I like. That means I'm going to spend time playing the game instead of doing other things. And that's... Somehow a problem. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. That's my horse. That's my horse. You go away, Maurice. Stay. Don't hit Alfred, come. Mist Rider plus me. Stop, 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 stop. Why is there a giant? Oh, boy. I think we need to move. I don't like I don't like this neighborhood, okay? It's not safe to raise our kids here, Raya. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. It's fine, it's fine, it's good, it's good, it's good. Just don't do the don't 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 do the slam. Don't do the don't do the quick slam. Don't do a quick slam. Don't do don't 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 do the quick slam. Don't don't Okay, there we go, and there we go. Alfred Cum just took a freaking sledge to the face. Oh. oh no, I told Lucia to go play outside. I hope she Hey Maurice! Is it much further to the sanctuary? No no no, we're on the right track, dude. We'll get any second now and we'll we'll be there. Don't don't you worry about a thing. Maybe your many lives this horse. Oh good. I'm so glad you're safe. Alright. I don't remember if that's Sigurd or who that is. Uh, I'm here at Lakeview though. This is my crib. Uh, do, I don't think we have anything to do here at Lakeview. I think we just move along, don't we? Why did I Oh, right. I, I came here for the, the carriage. It's going to leave me horseless, though. Uh, all right. But now, check this out. I can take this to... Oh, I could take it directly to Kynesgrove. Oh, that's crazy. Look at all these places I can go. Look at all these places I can go. If I've been there before. But we've definitely been to Iverstead. Let's go. Climbing back, and we'll be off. All right, Maurice. Raya. Let's freaking go. met one of them cats. Ajit, I think they called themselves. Ugh. I hear there's whole countries full of them down south. That's crazy. Battle trolls? Also battle trolls. Barbus is good. He's not a battle troll, you know? All right, Maurice. Uh, almost at the sanctuary now. They say Ulfric Stormcloak murdered I don't the think there's anything new Spoils. in Iberstedt. So we're just gonna continue along. Mean? As per Yush. Now, I'm kinda glad we don't have a horse. Uh, scaling should be done on foot, just so that we can respond to the dangers that come along the way. I also believe I never managed to properly check all the little stone inscriptions on the way up, right? I think I was- I, I missed one. So let's try to do that again. Emblem one. But I did read them out loud, so. Let's just hit that road. What 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 could possibly go wrong? It went wrong very fast. Stop. 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 All right. Oh. Maurice has not run into combat, so I think actually maybe the aggression thing is not relevant. Maybe that's fixed. Boy, we'll see. Boy, let's let let's not jinx it. Let's just. I don't think Maurice is the one needing protection. Bears are just so so feisty. You know? No! What? I didn't. Really? I'm halfway across the. I'll get back there. Okay, we're back. I just... I heard a bear already. And I'm like... Over there? Is that guy sleeping or dead? I just felt a little... Unsafe. Oh, that's why I felt unsafe. Okay. Okay. Is he back? Oh, no. He, he has fists out, but he's running a little back and forth. I think he's a little confused. Oh, 
Yes, he's fleeing. Very good. This increases our chances of success exponentially. Good job, Maurice. Proud of ya. Alright. Slap him on the rump. Pow pow. Alright, onwards. Plenty, plenty more steps to go. Plenty more to go. Let's also keep an eye out for those emblems along the way. So that's one of that's one of the things about traveling with the carriage, though. We don't actually get a horse with us. So that's interesting. That's an interesting trade-off. But I do think that it's going to help navigation in the later parts because a lot of quest lines, particularly the Thieves Guild quest line, revolves around visiting Riften, right? Go to Riften, get a mission, go out in the world. And if I had to physically run to Solitudes, it was going to eat up a lot of episode time. And I can't cut it out, of course. Um, but if I could do the carriage, I can fit a lot more into one, into one episode. Whoosh. Emblem 2. Men were born. So, Challenger 1, the bear. Not much of an issue. What comes next, though, is probably worse. Now, I think... We've already been playing for quite some time. I think once we reach the top and learn Fu's Roda... Yeah, I was, I was waiting for you. I think that would be a perfect spot to conclude episode 99. And then with Fu's Roda in hand... In the next one, we're gonna go kill ourselves a dragon. I haven't done that before. And I'm thinking, I was thinking we could uh, chase the uh, the diplomatic, uh, or start the diplomatic immunity quest, you know? Go up to Solitude, go attend a party. That just seems like a big, like very classic quest to do there. With some stealth and some, oh, opportunities for shenanigans. I can dig it. All right, Maurice. All clear. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> he still thinks we're going to the sanctuary. Uh, it's the darndest thing. <sighs> Man. 99 episodes. 99 weeks of doing it consistently. And that's... That's really helped, I think. Just having that expectation of not wanting to let anybody down. Which... You let me down, Mr. Bear, by... Existing. Okay, okay. But like knowing that, you know, it's Friday today and I have a tendency to put it off until the, you know, the latest possible day. But it's kind of become a routine now, you know? Get, st I will shove something up somewhere if you put me back to the... I have prayed, right? I just prayed, right? <sighs> this Maurice is ready to go, I guess. Okay, Mr. Frost Troll, how about we do this again, huh? But this time, I'm I'm really starting to feel not having Barbus, man. He was just he was he was always there for me. He was quicker to catch up than anybody else. Just uh, what a good boy. And now all I got's myself, and I'm not the goodest of boys, it seems. I keep getting mauled to death. It's lame. Cool boys don't do that. Oh, cool boys do that, though. That was great. That was great. Made up for it. Mistfire bless me. Let's freaking go. All right. Man. High Hrothgar is the one place that really makes you feel the no fast travel rule. <laughs> it's all good. We get to enjoy the scenery on the way up. I almost wish there was a skill like athletics in this game, so I had something to train while we're out running. The crazy part about athletics in Oblivion is that it was so slow to train that even after I'd walked to every single location and back, gotten all the freaking get away from... <gasps> after I'd walked all the way across Skyrim, I... Uh, Skyrim. Cyrodiil, I still had not maxed that freaking skills. Maybe I don't want to have athletics as a thing. But man, it sure was a... Sure was a skill of all time. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, there we go. Focus on them, not me. Misfire bless me. I'm nothing without Barbus. I want a troll or something. I need so something. I, I need I need something. Do you have any ideas for companions people should pick up? I mean, Serana. 
Serana is fun. That would be great. But I gotta earn it. I gotta earn it. I can't just rush Serana. It's gotta just come as a natural, you know, being at the right point in the land to do the right quest at the right time type of deal. Alrighty. Let's read the next emblem. Four. Three. Alright, so we're not that far along. That's okay. Should be halfway, right? Oh, what was that? No more. Not a snow bear, not a frost troll. What is it? I don't even know. Honestly, well, how bad can it be? What's what's up? Who's here? I don't know. Raya can deal with it. Sure, Maurice is. I should check on Maurice. Something's here. Hmm. There's probably not, there's probably some alternative ways up the mountain, right? That I could could scale. Hmm. Maybe I should have just taken the horse from White Run and just scaled. That sounds that sounds dangerous. We're doing the proper way for now. Oh damn! So far up. These guys sure like their seclusion. That's number four. Very nice. All right. <laughs> Maurice immediately screams. Yeah. Ah, he's he's trying to go somewhere. He's this he's aggressively cowardly, you know? Yes, he's like, I'll fight you as he runs away from me. Oh, I'll fight you. Oh, you just you wait as he rounds the corner. <laughs> I don't like this place. Mistfire, bless me. Oh, hey, don't do it. You have so much to all right. Wait. No, flamey, not you. Fl flamey, flamey, flamey. Earth to flamey. Need you down here. Ugh, you silly goose. All right. There we go. That's a little better. All right. It's nice. You just bash him a bit. It's all good. Oh boy. Yeah. Don't you try anything. I'm watching you. I don't like you. Alright. I think Raya went off to fight something in the hills. Maybe I should have checked in on her, but you know. Some... Oh boy, I don't have my wolves. Be careful here. Be very careful here. There we go. Perfect. Now then, number five. Yes, man prevailed. And then, put that down, sir. Now I think we only got one more corner. One more corner. A couple of bears. And we're there. Fu's Roda. A staple. A legendary staple. Like, what would Skyrim be if it wasn't for the shouts? It'd be, it'd be another RPG, you know? Your hero run around, hit things with the swords, but here with with roaring tongues to sky children conquer, you know, founding the first empire. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. And that should also be this one. Is this one I missed? Emblem seven. Ah, yes. Very good. And then there's one over here. I think I read them all, but I just. It messed up the orders. I got one on the way back. And almost there. What we got? Ah, uh, yes. Voice of the sky. Very nice. Let's check it out. V -v 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 Voice of the sky. Animals would neither attack nor flee from you. <gasps> That's wonderful. There's there's so so many bears that I can now just kind of casually stroll by. All right, there we go. They're catching up. All right, Maurice, Sanctuary's just around the corner. What's that? You, you, you weren't dressed to go scaling a mountain during winter? I uh, should have had some more foresight then. Oh. Hello. Oh, and now... Oh, okay, cool. So I have... Did I just skip one again? No, but okay, so I have read them all now. That's good. But they doesn't have to be in an order, it seems. And then there's that one. Okay, so I did read the one that I'd missed. Okay. Understand. The voices worship. 
All right, Maurice, how about you uh, hang tight here for a second, okay? Uh, potion of cure poison. We're back in High Hrothgar. All right. Oh, Maurice, you came inside? All right, sure. Didn't think you would. Hey, Wolfgar. Arngar! Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Wimkong. Mm hmm. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Mm hmm. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. You are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da. Which means push. Da. 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 Oh. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Alright, watch me, Maurice. Here we go. Master da. Wolfgar will now gift you with his knowledge of Da. That's so nice. Thanks, Wolfgar. It is done. Unrelenting force. I, I you can't. have completed it. your training, Dragonborn. We would speak to you. Yeah. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Oh no. If you can but withstand the unbridled Maurice. Of the but you are ready. He didn't sign up for this. <gasps> oh, dude, Maurice too. Oh no. He's gonna be Dragonborn now. This is totally normal. Don't worry about it. It's just my some friends of mine. Oh no, Maurice. They ain't done yet. Oh. oh, this is weird. Oh. I, I, I think we're good, Maurice. We did it. Is it much further to the sanctuary? <laughs> Dover King, you have tasted the voice of it's the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. Thank you. The Horn of Jurgen Windcaller, everybody. That's huge. Your training proceeds well, Dragonborn. What was that ceremony all about? Were you shouting at me? We spoke the traditional words of greeting to a dragonborn who has accepted our guidance. The same words were used to greet the young Talos when he came to High Hrothgar before he became the Emperor Tiber Septim. What did you actually say? Ah, I sometimes forget you are not versed in the dragon tongue as we are. This is a rough translation. Long has the storm crown languished, with no worthy brow to sit upon. By our breath, we bestow it now to you, in the name of Kain, in the name of Shore, and in the name of Atmora of old. You are Ismir now, the dragon of the north. Hearken to it. Very cool. Sky above, voice within. Sky above, voice within. Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. Uh, don't worry about it. We're we're going. Next episode, though. Oh, Maurice, you're oh, he's a lucky guy. He's in for a treat. Next episode is episode one, freaking hundred. Oh, man, man, oh man. We don't have Lydia with us. But... Maurice? Okay, so it's just freaking... Don't... What are you trying to do? He's so... Impushliten is the word I want to use, okay? But I don't know how best I translate that. Alright. Can... Can... Okay. Okay, okay. We good, Morris? I need I need to shout someone off the top. I just learned the foos and the rolls. I gotta. I've worked so hard for Maurice. Raya, she can take it. She's a trooper. Raya? Yes, my thane. 
Do you need something? I don't want to ask her to wait though, cause then. Lead on then. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Check this out. Check this out. I'm just gonna have to lead her, cause if I ask her to wait. Oh wait, this is what I do. We've stopped. I need you yes, to do something. Thane. What is it? Okay. Yes, my thing. Wait there. Will do. Like many companions before her. That it. Okay, but I await your orders, Thane. Follow me. My blade is yours to command. Stand right there. Don't move. <gasps> Mistfire bless me. You know what? Let's just let's just Mistfire really bless me. Here it comes. You ready? You ready? <gasps> no! <laughs> no, but I, I thought for sure. I, I thought for sure I had the. That's so stupid. I thought I thought I put it on. I re I honestly. What's brother? Dovakin, Dovakin, not a single She's bouncing. She's she's bouncing. She getting up? Yeah, she's getting up. All right, Maurice, do do as I do as I say, not as I do. Uh, we got to get down from here somehow. <laughs> that sounds like a perfect episode 100 material, if you ask me. Well, well, well. Uh, she uh, she's not gonna join us again, is she? <laughs> yeah, I take that as an insult too. But at least we get a beautiful, beautiful sunset here. Ah, uh, yes. Just you and me, buddy. Let's just situate ourselves on the cliffs. Make sure you don't walk around too much. And yeah. Let's watch this. How is Raya? Oh, she's fine. She'll walk it off. Let's just watch that freaking setting sun. Well, everybody. Episode 99 has come and gone. Without much incident, some incident. Uh, we got Maurice with us now. Wasn't planned, but... We'll see how it goes. Next time around, it's the big episode 100. It's going to be an extra long one where I think we're going to hit Elder Gleam, kill that dragon, uh, diplomacy, diplomatic immunity quests. We'll see what happens, but it's going to be a good time, and I hope you're going to tune in for the 100th episode of Savior of Skyrim. So, until then, have a still good day, take care, and stay awesome. But most importantly, everybody, stay dark. Goodbye.